Now I've already gone and started working on this project, uh, which is a bearded axe. I'm in the process of gluing down its first level of cloth before wrapping it uh, and making it playable on the field. So this project grew, turned into two items. But that's just on the side here. What's really happening is I've got these rim glued down. And I'll be doing it on the other side as well. And then I'll be putting some kind of an emblem or something here yet. I haven't quite figured it out. And then I'll be using this heat gun to heat a butter knife. And I'm going to use the butter knife to put lines in it to make it look like it's boards. And actual wood. Maybe put some grain knots in it here and there. So should look pretty neat when it's done. But again, it still needs to be trimmed up and, and shaved up. I found a use for all of my old jars. Whee! weigh it down. This is how we're gonna get it to stay together. I just went ahead and glued my front cross on my punch shield just so everybody can see where it is now. It's coming along. Well, once this dries, it'll be time to Plasti Dip spray. Yay! Okay, don't know if you can see that, but I took my heat gun there, I heated up a knife, and then I made some, uh, some wood grain look. It's not all that great, but it'll serve its purpose. Uh, and I can give it that little stud there. So now I'm going to Plasti Dip spray this thing. And that's the next step. Uh, after, I think I'm going to put a cap on here. Today I'm gonna have some more camp pad, and I'm gonna take a piece and run it all the way around the edge one last time and then I'm going to Plasti Dip spray this and seal it before we paint. Next! Here it goes. Hmm, this looks a lot like spray paint. Treat it the same way. Let it dry. All right. Let me go clean her up. Yeah. Whoa. Found out there's something going on with the crows in the neighborhood. Some DARPA thing. Some initiative. Yeah, if I find the link, I'll I'll post it in, in the uh, descriptions of this video. I just want to make it as flush as I can here. Which 
Ta da! Alright. <clears throat> Next is hit it with some more Plasti Dip and I will then begin painting it. Finally. Then I went ahead and sprayed it again. Uh, some of this plasti dip to kind of seal it up, seal up the handle. Now I gotta wait for it to dry. I'll probably give it overnight to let it dry. And then I'll start painting it first thing in the morning. See you there. Alright, so I've added some paint to it after it dried, a little bit of a little bit of brown, brown in here to make it look like wood. And uh I got my little my burgundy button here, but I'm gonna get a metallic color. I'm gonna do the rim to make it look like you know it's banded metal. Sorry, my voice is a little harsh. I uh, performed last night in Lake City, and uh, when I perform, I I shout at people a lot from the stage, so I tend to uh, I tend to throw my voice sometimes. All right, there you go. Let's take a look. It's getting pretty. An artist pallid, a must be professional. No, seriously, cardboard works. My kids got me this awesome art set for Christmas, so I'm using some of some of it, some of its colors, as well as I went out to Michaels and picked up the Artists Loft brand. Got some silver, got some deep magenta, so I can make my burgundy, and I can make my gunmetal by adding a little bit of black and then I'm going to add some lighter brown on maybe this board here so the boards look like they're made of uh, different types of wood various ages let's see how it turns out eh apply the colors oh without getting on your old wood <laughs> Old wood colors out. Any smears we'll just take care of once we get the bulk of this on. But this is gonna this is gonna be an awful lot uh, of paint required for this. So I made a big pile. It's really gonna make the cracks show up too, which I don't know. Maybe I can jam some paint down in there and get that. We'll see. See what I can do. I'll be back in a few seconds with much more of this done. All right. I made it metal colored. Pretty cool, huh? Let's see if we get a shot of that right there. Alright. Let this dry. I'm going to do some of the boards inside. When you see it next, it will be completed. And there you have it. Completed. Painted. I, think I even made it look like each board was a different type of wood. Isn't that neat? Didn't have to do that, but he did. Awesome. Next thing to do is test this sucker out. Thanks for watching. There's a shield. I'll get it banned. There you go. Yes. Nice.